Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time, please subscribe to my old people. Thank you for coming back. So today's video, <laughs> today's video is something different, okay? I have decided to react to these trendy videos that have been going around social media, okay? I picked them myself and they are really hilarious. So I just wanted to share my reaction with you guys because these videos are worth reacting towards. So, without wasting too much time, the first one, of course, this one is from Cameroon. Our own Cameroonian celebrities. Like our music industry is just doing the most okay. Now I'm going to play the <laughs> I'm going to play the video. Why am I laughing? I'm going to play the first video. I don't want to give an opinion. I'm going to try my best not to give an opinion. I'm just going to simply react and then I leave because I don't know much about the industry, but however I pray I don't give an opinion. Anyways, let's just let me just watch and you know we'll do it together. So this, the first video is from a Cameroonian artist called Kosi and Kosi is bashing another artist, okay? Let me first of all just play the video, we watch together and then I'll come and I'll talk more because he was trying to talk in code, like he was trying to use code language but don't worry, I'm here, I'll reveal all the names. <laughs> Anyways, let's watch. The other day I watched video, I almost cried. Mm -hmm. I watch video where someone can't talk saying no, there are only two people. He you know, you know the one and the other one. Mm. And then the person went there and they stand for the man in front of the man to say, he know there are only two people who come home. He then they laugh. Very stupid. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know that you can put on front there and that. Very stupid. Hmm. Then they laugh. Hmm. Because some man can't talk say, for inside your country, he you know there are only you one. Anger. And so other person is sweet. Anger. Anger, why you about vex me? Feed you. For you to stand for the day, you must say no, bro. For inside here, mm. we get, we get talented people. We get talented artists then. Mm. Watch their videos, check their YouTube. Their name like this, their name like this, their name like this. Not the only one. Mm. You need to laugh. Open your teeth. Two dirty teeth. Mm. Laugh, laugh, laugh with him. Odo. You need to laugh your stupidity. <laughs> you're laughing at your calamity. You dull. Let me tell you the names. Kosi was addressing Stanley Eno, who is another artist. I believe in Cameroon is bigger than Kosi. Yes. Yes. We can say Stanley Eno is bigger than Kosi. He's been in the game longer than Kosi. He's more experienced and I feel like he's more respected than Kosi. Kosi too is a good one. But he's talking about Stanley Eno. There was a time that the video came to Cameroon and he made this statement on a video. Which I don't know whether it's Stanley Eno shared or... David who shared, he was like, the only, he knows only two people in Cameroon, Eto Fils and Stanley Eno. And <laughs> that's why, that, those are the people that he was referring to. So the person who was talking about is Eto, is David Doe, and David Doe was wanting me to take me. But, after he made this video, hmm? I'm just going to say this. I watched the entire video that the video made that statement, but at the end of the video, the video said Cameroon has good music and we should try to put our artists on the map. You know, I feel like he was clowning, it was nothing serious. They were all joking. But you know how the public is, we are sensitive and we pick things, we do selective posting, we post what we want to post. So, yes, but after he did this video, the internet came for him. He was he he was he was mommy he was dragged. Like drag, but man, because he, he he had the same experience with another Nigerian artist who also said he does not know any other artist in Cameroon apart from him. He also laughed, bah, 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 bah. but now he's saying things. Anyways, let me be going. You know, I'm done with that one. Like I was just the most interesting part. Let me rewind again. The name that is, the name that is not the only one. You didn't laugh. Open your teeth. Two dirty teeth. Laugh, laugh, laugh with you. Mm -mm. You love your stupidity. One does. <laughs> that place with me, oh. You are 32 dirty teeth. Hi. Go see. Baby. Moving on. The next video me I want to react to. Me, I don't know. I'm going to say this if I play this video. Eh, I'm going to just say this very fast. I have only one question, oh. This Nigerian actresses, is it only from this acting that they need this kind of big money? Anyways, that's not my concern, oh. But... This is 
this one is is concern this video concerns uh, mercy aibe let me call it like the real Yoruba person mercy aibe she's a very good nigerian actress you know she's a very good actress and the other day she posted this video on her insta on her instagram page where her friend gifted her range rover where are my friends like should i start calling your names why are you be your friend give, give them Range Rover? <laughs> hey, Jesus, this this actress is okay, somebody. Else. But let's just watch it together. I beg you people should see the surprise. This is when this is when they brought her to the place. See her face, see her face, see, 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 see. see. The best part is coming. See, 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 see. Did you guys see that that tears yes, that fake that uh, Ajebota fake crying? Wait, let's continue. See, 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 see. Oh no, no, no! The best part is still coming. We wait now. See, 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 see. see, see. That's it, that's it. See, 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 see. Hey, Willie. Yeah. See, that's a friend. God, God. God, should I change friends? So, the comments under that, that video finished me. They just finished me like I died. Some people were like, lie. Now that was a lie. That, as in, even myself, I don't want to say anything. Oh. I don't want to say anything, but chai, mercy. Chai. Ha. So your friend will just sit. Because, like, you really have that kind of rich friend that can gift you Range Rover. I'm not saying anything, I'm just asking. Because me, I want to be friends with that person. They ask me. Some friends are good, Osha. Ha. The comment section was booming. <laughs> the way I'm noticing this 2021, eh? things I'm not used to do. Me, on that comment section, I like Nigerians, you know, that they don't take it easy. They will just bash you and they just tell you it's a lie. I remember this same thing happened last, I think it was last year with Nengi. I think it was, there was someone, it was a fan page, they posted a video and they were like, the fans, uh, Nengi's fans have bought her Range Rover and she was there making, ah, ha, come and see comment section. <clears throat> the most interesting part eh, of such, such videos is always comment section for me. I live for comment section. Come and see bashing. Just they lie anyhow. We see Nigerians with, that, with, their, co with their comments and their accents. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Rangy, as in brand new Rangy. So my friend Molly's, Elena, yeah, all of them. They will just sit and buy me one big Rangy. Hmm. I really need rich friends too. I really need rich friends that can spend that kind of money. Anyways, let me not judge. Let's go. The last video I'm going to react to is this. This one is a very serious one and it makes sense to me. Personally, and I, I don't know what you guys think, but there's this viral video of this girl. She made this video on TikTok, and she's talking about you know um, European countries basically bashing African countries as being poor. And then just listen to how she analyzed it, and I don't know if it's going to make sense to you, but let's reason it together. Since I moved to Sweden, I've been hearing Africa poor, Africa poor, Africa. Mm. How is it that a nation that lives under credit mm. is calling Africa poor? Don't bash me, I'm going to give you an example, okay? Mm -hmm. In Uganda, if you see someone walking around with an iPhone 12, they paid cash for yes. it. If you see someone having a house, they built it cash. Mm -hmm. If you see someone driving a car, it's cash. Because in the world where I come from, if you don't have the money, then you can't buy. We mm -hmm. don't have credit. Mm -hmm. Take example, Sweden. I can go to a shop, get an iPhone 12, credit. House, credit. Car, credit. Everything is credit. Mm -hmm. Even underwear, you can get it on credit. credit. So technically, if you lose your job, you lose everything mm -hmm. and you can go to the streets. Yes. Okay? Yes. In Uganda, if you lose your job, you get to keep everything. You will just worry, where am I going to get money for school fees? Then it came to me like, how the hell the people who live in credit call people who pay cash poor? What she said made sense to me. Anyway, she's talking about Uganda. Let me talk about my own country, Cameroon. I've been out of Cameroon for a very long time, so, but I know things have changed. And like she said, if you see somebody holding something in Cameroon, it is their own. So I was saying that there's no way you go to the shop in Cameroon and you want to get a phone and they say you make a payment plan. It doesn't happen, but that's what we do here in the abroad. Car, you can do that. 
um, house you can do that but in Cameroon if you see somebody living, living in their house they built that they built that house from scratch they paid from scratch and it is their house okay sometimes granted you go to the uh, credit union to the bank you take loans you know but that's different you take those loans and you pay that's the only way you make payment plan planning in Cameroon but here we can basically live on credit as long as you're working you can live on credit till you die so I don't know what this I don't know what you guys think about what she said I just felt like it was something that I should bring here so you guys we should all deliberate on is it true do you really think um, so let's just discuss in the comment section what do you guys think anyways that's all for this video guys um, it's just something that I think I'll be doing on this channel if I see a video that needs reaction I'll be reacting I'll be coming here and giving my opinion and whatever Thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. If you like things like this, you let me know. Maybe I'll react to more videos or you can send me videos if you want me to react to videos. I can do that as well. Thank you for watching once more. Stay pretty, stay slaying, always smile. See you in the next one. Bye, guys.